Let me tell you about my first $20,000 weekend. It's Najee Dorsey, and you're with Naj now. All right. You know, and this is not indicative of any success anybody else is going to have. I got colleagues that do extremely much more than that. This is probably uh, 2005 is when I started to do shows, hit the road. This would have been, I don't know, seven, eight years in. Um, anyway, let me, tell you, let me tell you about my first $20,000 show and the lesson that, that I learned from that, right? So I found myself down in Florida with a colleague of mine and we went and did this small promoter show. Wasn't about anything. And, and Sandy was like, hey, she knew about this show that was happening in Los Olas. Um, it was a Howard, Howard Island show. Of course, you know, you had to be juried in to get into the show. Wasn't juried in. And Sandy was like, you know, let's just show up and see what happens. Sometimes people don't, don't pay a booth, uh, don't show up for a show. So we go. Get there. Granted, there's a line of, of artists trying to get into the show. There's a ton of artists setting up. I saw the promoter's wife. I can't remember her name. I went up to her, introduced myself, and I say, you know, I'm Najee. You know, remember me? Did you show up and so on? So you always like my work. You always like my presentation. Listen, if you got any spaces available, keep me in mind. I would love to do the show. I'm here, you know, and I'm available. And she she told me. She said, well, listen, we've got a lot of artists here trying to get the show together. Uh, if something come up, I'll let you know. Okay, so I hung out for a while, but I noticed that she was trying to direct traffic, trying to get artists in particular places, and was having a hard time with the traffic thing. So I immediately jump in. What do I do? Hold traffic, you know, help her do this, help her do that. And she looked at me and she said, you know what? I got, I may have something for you. Came back five minutes later. She took me to this space and said, listen, this is the only booth I got available. Granted, it's the first thing you see, but technically it's at the end of the show, out at the far reaches, and I said, I'll take it, right? Didn't know what they expect, you just never know. So, end up doing the show, first day, the first day was great. Uh, that Saturday, must have done $7,000 that Saturday. Get to the hotel at night, had a lot of cash, throwing cash everywhere, laying on the bed, we balling, you know, having a great time, this and that. And Sunday come around, and I noticed that there was these, you know, two older ladies that just kept coming back to my booth, right? And, you know, typically I'm not, you know, not necessarily trying to, when I'm in a, in a show environment, I'm not necessarily trying to talk to artists about, you know, work and this and that. But for some reason, these ladies were really cool. And she came back, and I'll never forget. She said, she said, how much is that one? I said, 4000 She said, well, how much is that one? I said, the same price, 30 by 40 paintings at the time. She said, I take that one and this one in. She said, well, how much is that? At the end of the day, she spent over $13,000, which took me over the $20,000 threshold. The money's great, you know, don't get me wrong. It's a, it's a great experience. The lesson is this though. What do you take away from that? Jump in where you fit in. Jump in, I'll, you know, be looking to help, help piece a puzzle and to help solve somebody else's problem could actually be to your benefit. Like I had no idea. I was just trying to be helpful, uh, what that could lead to. And sometimes even when you get in and you think that you may be at a disadvantage, you know, by being on the far reaches of the thing, you just never know what blessing may come, you know, be in your pathway, what may come your way. So be open to, to good experiences, you know, make good decisions, build great relationships, you know, because you just never know. It could be your time, it could be your moment, and it could be your weekend. This is Najee with Naj Nah. Hope that helps.